Hello, and a very warm welcome. Another rant participating on the channel. Over to you, Kevin Magnuson. Kevin Magnuson, stand up and be counted. After the summer break, no, we'll have a shit qualifying. We'll pull it in the wall, coming out the pit lane in FP3. Destroyed the car. We qualify 18th. We start from the pit lane. We finish behind our teammate once again. He has been absolutely wanked this season. There's no getting away from it. Up there with one of the worst drivers of 2023. If not for Logan Sargent, this guy has to be the worst driver. He's been absolutely piss poor. And maybe he got away with it last season. He got high praise last season. Beating Mick's surname. Well, he's up against a teammate with a set of balls. And he's come unstuck. Kevin Magnussen being absolutely shite this season. There's no getting away from it. He needs to step it up. Just been offered a new contract. He should be on the verge of sacked. He's been absolutely wank. And that's putting it kindly. Anyone wants to come on the channel and stick up for Kevin Magnussen. Be my guest. Because you can't defend. Shit. Rubbish. Absolutely wank. High praise last season. Beating Mick's surname. But no. Yeah. Hulkenberg finishes 12th, Magnussen once again 16th, stinking the joint out. Hulkenberg has got Magnussen's number and Magnussen needs to step up and be counted. He's he's basically lives at Haas F1. I mean, you just see it. He comes out the pits, lights it up, puts it in the wall. Gunter's pissed off with him. Yeah, it's been a shocking campaign by Kevin Magnussen. He's got two points on the board. Hulkenberg has nine it's not good enough. Kevin Magnussen, rubbish. Has a rate for the constructors, and that's mainly down to Kevin Magnussen. They should easily be ahead of Williams. They're not because of one man, Kevin Magnussen. Stinking the joint out every single race. He's been so poor, it's actually laughable. I'm angry. I'm not even a Kevin Magnussen fan, but I'm boiling. He boils my piss this season. He's been shit. Shit, shit, shit. 13th, I uh, want to get his results up because, yeah, he's been utterly garbage. Yeah, a strong ramp, but it's got to participate. He has been shocking, shocking. I can't believe how bad he's been. He's an experienced man. McLaren, Reynolds, you know, Haas F1. He's an experienced man. There's no excuses. He had a year out. He came back. Performed superb, but maybe we gave him too much credit because, um, you know, he's up against Mick's surname. But he's been found out. He has been well and truly found out. Hulkenberg has got this guy's number. He finishes 13th Bahrain. He scores a point in Saudi. 17th in Australia. 13th Azerbaijan. Miami, he scores a point. Monaco, 19th. Spain, 18th. Canada, 17th. 18th in Austria. It's fucking piss. Retires at Silverstone. 17th Hungary. 15th Belgium. 16th. There's no way. You cannot defend the indefensible. Kevin Magnussen should be under pressure for the sack, in my opinion. He's an experienced man. There's no excuses. And yeah, he's just been given a new contract. How is he warranting that new contract on the back of his performances this season? Two points. Wow. Hulkenberg, he's been out like three years. And he's got nine points, seven more. Really poor. He's consistently behind Nico Hulkenberg. Magnussen needs to up his game. I'm so surprised he's been given a contact. contract. Has have gone too early with that one. Uh, yeah, they've definitely gone too early. Magnussen should be at risk of being sacked. Sergeant. Stroll, Magnussen, Guang Yu Zhou, Valtteri Bottas. There's five I've just reeled off. Sergio Perez is another one. There's six men who are under pressure. But we're too nice. We want to be best mates with everyone. Fuck that, man. You've given him a contract on the back of what? Been with the team a while and he's an experienced man. His performances don't warrant a new contract. He's been shit. Um, yeah. Full on ramp mode. I'm not a Magnussen fan, but I'm passionate about Formula 1. For me, 
I mean, the media won't call this out because, you know, they just don't, do they? Straight down the pipe, Magnussen has been shit this season. How he's got a new contract, I'll never know. I don't understand it. I really don't. Um, yeah. So, a Magnussen rant. Comment down below your thoughts on the Danish vank Viking. Viking? Viking? Um, yeah, not good enough. He needs to up his game. I want to see a bit of passion. I want to see a bit of aggression at Monza. I want to see him put... Silence me. Put a marker down. Get ahead of Nico Hulkenberg. Because right now, you're Nico Hulkenberg's lapdog. You talk about suck my balls, mate. Well, Hulkenberg is literally, you know, you are the one on the receiving end. Hulkenberg's dominating you in every aspect. And he's been out three years, tossing it up on a sunbed. Time to shine, Kevin Magnussen. Very early, Haas F1 have gone on that contract. Tomorrow, we'll probably be doing another rant, uh, participating. I've gone different this week. We did the preview on Tuesday, Magnussen rant Wednesday. You can probably guess who it's going to be tomorrow. And then we might calm down and concentrate on the Monza weekend. I'm passionate about their sport. Um, yeah. And if drivers are not pulling their way, I don't care who you are. I don't care who you are. Whether you're George Russell, my driver, Lewis Hamilton, called him out many times when I supported him. Leclerc, Sainz, Max, Perez. You don't perform, you're getting called out on this channel. I don't care whether you're four foot or one foot tall. 